personally prefer the older, just like all gold and white band better. But this. Every single day. Hey guys, Tony the Story Sass Assassin. Welcome to another episode of Cigar Review. Today we have the Charter Oak Pasquale um, cigar. This is from Working Man Cigar. He sent this to me as a bomb, so I'm gonna try it. Uh, hopefully, this is a good cigar uh, based on my research. Let's put it up. This is uh, MSRP at $13. Uh, it has Connecticut broadleaf as wrapper, binder, and filler wrapper from Nicaraguan. Uh, supposedly be a medium to full cigar, so we're gonna see what happens. Uh, this is a five and a half by forty-eight, kind of a box pressed, I think. Corona, like a kind of a box pressed. So this is one of the newest thing. I don't know if I like the new logo. I kind of like the old logo. So uh, we'll see what this one do. It does have another like a Connecticut um, lighter leaf version of it. Let's see if I can find what's the other one made out of. The other one is made out of. Connecticut Shade wrapper. This is Connecticut Broadleaf, I believe. Based on the color, I'm gonna say this is the the the, the Broadleaf. So, Broadleaf it is. Yep. Foundation Chato Oak, Especial Pasquale. Uh, I believe this is made by AJ Fernandez as well. So. Uh, let's look at this cigar just a little bit. It's got a little pigtail in there. Box press. So it's a little bit fancy. Um, the box press is uneven too, but shouldn't bother me too much. Just a little bit woodsy smell. There's not much smell to it. Yeah, I don't smell. Not really meant anything. So let's cut and light. Dry is okay. Cold dry. Leather and cocoa is what I got. Let's light it up. Oh, right away. Right away, woodsy, cocoa. A little bit of leather, just a little bit. A little bit of peppery too, spice. A little bit of sweetness. Mm. A little bit of like a char taste to it too. But that could be just me lighting it up. Everything's a little bit of everything.
The cocoa is very close to espresso. It's very close. Very, very close. Very tasty cigar, actually. Um, surprisingly. Very tasty. Very a lot of flavor. A lot of flavor. Alright, there's also a little bit of earthiness too. A little bit of uh, like wet dirt. But very little. That cocoa is dominant. Alright, let me smoke one third. I'll be right back. So I'm one third of the way through. This cigar has a lot of flavor. Surprisingly a lot of flavor. This cigar is good. A lot of cocoa. A lot of cocoa. Woodsy cocoa. Some peppery. This, um, very little pepper, like very, very little, and kind of get my throat tingle a little bit. So, other than that, the cigar is good. The cigar is surprisingly good. A lot of cocoa. I can smoke this entire cigar that's like this right now. If they don't change, I'm okay with that because it tastes really good. So, um, strength, I say it's about medium, medium strength. Right now, I don't know if you gotta ramp up. Uh, it burned a little bit funny. I had to fix it a little bit, but other than that, so far so good. Good cigar right now. Uh, I remember I said six. How much was this? Sixteen dollars. Double check. Thirteen dollars. Thirteen dollars right now. Yeah, I can see thirteen dollars. So far so good. Let's go into the second third. Be right back. Okay, second third. Now second third. The flavor died down a little bit, but now it's more complex. You get cocoa, you get a little bit of cashew nut, and you get a little bit of leather. Very little earthiness, very little of pepper. Uh, that's pretty much it, but it's more complex. It's more sweet. Uh, more put together, put together. I still like that cocoa note, and with that pepper. Now I think the pepper is more like um, bell pepper. That's a little bit sweet, you know. It's it's a little bit spicy, but a little bit sweet. It's actually quite complex of a taste. It's really good cigar. Thirteen bucks. I do thirteen bucks any day. This is a good cigar. Um. Strain still about medium right now. It does burn wonky, but nothing too serious. Um, I like the cigar. Cigar tastes really good. I just, I just, you know, as I smoke, I'm kind of afraid that the, the full body, uh, full strain is gonna kick in. But it didn't yet. It's just medium right now. So I'm smoking it slowly. I'm enjoying it. It's very flavorful. Uh, I'm surprised how much flavor is in this tiny cigar. Really does. I, and it's really, really good. So yeah, last third right now. We'll get to it, but before that, here's the new band. I personally prefer the older, just like all gold and white band better. But this band, I guess, it's more raw, more vintage, I think, in a way. I don't know. I like the old band better. That's just me. That's, that's just... Yeah, me. Anyways, so, Laster, be right back. <laughs> Laster, one thing I want to mention about... Um, this cigar is that its smoke output is crazy. There's a lot of smoke output on this cigar. Tastes really good. It got a little bit more peppery at the end. Um, again, the flavors throughout is very pleasant the flavor. You get a little bit of leather, you get a little bit of chestnut, you get a little bit of uh, cocoa, you get a little bit of uh, bell pepper, red bell pepper. Um, a little bit of earthiness. Overall, I think it's a good balance. Um, for what you get, and I barely feel the strength. So medium. Some people say it's full, but I think it's more towards a medium. Uh, I think everybody can can enjoy the cigar. It's not very big, so by the time you feel the strength, you're probably already done with the cigar. Good cigar. Big thanks to our Walking Man Cigar Roger sending me the cigar. This, uh, I'm surprised I had a good review on this thing because I was like, ah, it's gotta be strong. I don't know, broad leaf. But it turned out to be really good. So it's a good cigar. I recommend it. $13 any day. In fact, I'll pay $14 for it. $14, $15, it will be fine. Like in my mind, I thought it was $16, but it's, it's $13 cigar. I think $14, $15, no problem. This cigar is good, uh, enjoyable, relatively good smoke time. Pretty much got everything. Uh, 
but I do want to say I do still like the old band. <laughs> the the band, the band kind of makes it I don't know less attractive to me a little bit. So, well, it is what it is. I would recommend the cigar. Go get it, try it, see if you like it. All right, and if you like it, make sure to comment. If you like the video, make sure to like, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.